Thank you very much, Sri Panna, for coming all the way uh, from Patna. Uh, friends, we are uh, very much uh, honored to have Dr. Uh, Sri Panna Saha, who is an assistant professor at IIT Patna, and she is one among the recipients of uh, BioCruise Innovation Research and Development Award for the year 2016. Thank you, Sri Panna. Uh, can you please recall you know, what inspired you to take a bioinformatics? Yes, so uh, I did my PhD in computer science uh, in the year 2011. So during my PhD, I applied, I, de I developed some machine learning algorithms, clustering algorithms, and uh, I applied those techniques for solving uh, some problems related to computer science, like satellite image segmentation, etc. And then uh, after, uh, after joining as a professor in IIT Patna, I found that maybe I can make some applications in bioinformatics also. Because many of the problems are very much challenging, and uh, and those are very real life problems. That way, I can also contribute for some for some for human beings. So I then I started applying this machine learning algorithm for solving this gene expression data classification problems, cancer classification problems. And my elder brother also died because of cancer, and that is another motivation of uh, doing something in cancer research. So currently my PhD students are working on cancer problems. We are trying to solve uh, different solutions based on machine learning uh, to do much, some uh, cancer research. Very much motivational and inspirational. But did you ever feel that you are you are fish out of sea with, uh, with so vast you know mathematics field and with less support uh, negating you know your your specialization? Yes, so, so I also believe that if you would like to do a good research in bioinformatics. You should have a good knowledge of biology as well as informatics. So I have a good knowledge in informatics, but I, do not, I am not an expert in biology. So that is the problem I am facing. So I need to study biology, but I am not getting always the time to study the biology. And in, in the technical institutes like, like IIT, we are getting these students who are coming from the computer science background. They also have very little knowledge in biology, and they are not motivated to re do research in biological field. So sometimes I need to boost them, I need to motivate them that these are some real life problems where you can contribute. Uh, but still that is a problem that we are facing. So we need to get some help from biologists who can uh, help us, who can basically uh, clear, uh, who can basically guide us how to apply this machine learning techniques for solving different kind of biological problems. And we are also facing uh, the problem how to validate the results. So we are applying machine learning algorithms, we are getting results, but how to validate